Stephen Hawking and Yuri Milner are joining forces to discover what's behind Matthew McConaughey's bookshelf. And if you ask me, I think it's Jodie Foster's dad. Double alien movie reference! Early this morning in a live broadcast, Stephen Hawking and Russian entrepreneur Yuri Milner announced a plan to provide $100 million in funding over the next decade to SETI, the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence. The plan is called Breakthrough Listen, which sounds like a uh, self-help book, but is actually really cool. The project is set to start searching the universe for aliens next year, and it's focusing on the one million closest stars to Earth. Most of the money will be spent purchasing time at various radio telescopes around the world, including this football field-sized National Radio Astronomy Observatory dish in Green Bank, West Virginia. NASA's Kepler spacecraft has so far detected hundreds of extrasolar planets in the Milky Way alone, which indicates that we're probably like surrounded by aliens. Like there are probably like billions of planets really similar to Earth around us all the time, and everyone is full of aliens, and we're all gonna die. I am personally full of aliens. <laughs> you are full of aliens. We are all full of aliens. In addition to Breakthrough Listen, they've also announced Breakthrough message, which is a competition to come up with the message that we will send out to the aliens if the aliens send one out to us. And the prize for the best message is up to one million dollars. So you all know that you're really good at Twitter, get working on this. Stephen Hawking said, it is time to commit to finding the answer to search for life beyond Earth. The breakthrough initiatives are making that commitment. We are life, we are intelligent, we must know. But interestingly, back in 2010, Stephen Hawking actually warned us that aliens might not be friendly and might be more interested in like colonizing us than being our buds, which is kind of creepy. Let's look at some tweets. Edward Current says, aliens do not exist in this universe at all. All. Get used to it. In 100 years, this will be an accepted fact. Sorry, Seti. You can tell this guy is smarter than Stephen Hawking because his bio says that he's a YouTube comedian. Astro Duff says, Yuri Milner's breakthrough listen is an incredible jump in humanity's ability to find ET. Are we alone? I can't wait to find out the answer. I know that you mean just like extraterrestrial life in general, but I'm thinking that you're talking about ET in particular. ET. <laughs> Oh, um, so. so what do you guys think? Is anybody out there? Leave us a comment and let us know. Give us a like and subscribe for more of What's Trending.